Hello Yeti Mike fans, I'm Kevin Ripa and this is my Sans 3 Minutes Max. In the last episode, I talked about how the internet is broken, or it's getting very close to that. And now I want to talk about how do we go about starting to fix this. Well, a lot of what is wrong here is the fact that uh, too much stuff is free today. So because everything's free, it has to be paid for somehow, so information gets collected. And the companies that are collecting all this information hide behind EULAs and technologies so that nobody can get at them. Well, the adversary uses a lot of these same technologies. So for example, VPNs. Somebody hides behind a VPN sitting in their grandmother's basement in Redactistan, and they're hacking computers on this side of the world. They're sending out ransomware. How do we stop them? Here is how we stop them. Radical crazy. Let's turn the internet into a country. We'll call it Pangea for the sake of this example. In order to be a citizen of Pangea, you must hold a passport for Pangea. In our example, the, you wouldn't have an act, a, a passport as we know a passport. You would have a CAC, a common access card, just like the U.S. military uses. So Pangea would be governed by elected officials. Sound crazy? ICANN is already that. They're a group of elected officials who oversee the Internet. So let's expand on that. Let's have elections. The citizenry of the internet gets to vote in these elections. But you have to have this CAC. You have to have a passport in order to be a citizen of Pangea. Now, uh, when you start looking at that, make it like a real country. Give Pangea a seat in the, Uni in the United Nations for as effective as the United Nations is. I'm talking about just, just to give it validation. And guess what? Pangea has its own police force. And if you are a citizen of Pangea, the police can come and arrest you for crimes committed in Pangea, no matter where you are. Sound ridiculous? Well, I'll tell you what. If Redactistan citizens want to be a citizen of Pangea as well, then that has to be allowed in Redactistan. If Redactistan says no, a police officer uh, is not going to come onto our soil and arrest one of our Redactistan citizens, well, then you don't get to be a part of Pangea. You can have the old internet and the cesspool that it already is. Does that mean that we lose some anonymity? We lose a lot of anonymity. But let's face it, if you're some, some shit funnel trying to get free Netflix from the United States because you're in some other country and your Netflix sucks, and that's why you're using a VPN? You shouldn't be able to hide behind the VPN. We need to have all of our activity be tracked by this CAC so that if you do something wrong, it can be tracked back to you. But how do we pay for all of this? My goodness. A police force? A country? We're going to talk about that in the next episode. But in the meantime, and in between time, that's it. The next episode of 3 Minutes Max.